Hi everyone, I'm Nancy McNally with another long arm quick quilting tip, except for today is going to be all about my little mini ditch ruler. Promise you it's short and sweet and to the point. First of all, there's a notch cut out in the side that fits around your foot, your hopping foot. So here's what I do. I use this mini ditch ruler every time I have to stitch in the ditch really, really close to applique. And as you can see, I'm still working on the red quilt that is all applique. So the mini ditch ruler offers me stability, offers me balance, because normally I quilt with just my right hand and my left hand is free to make adjustments with the quilt. But when I do applique or I have to stitch in the ditch on something, you know, just depending on what it is, I really want well, honestly, I have to use my left hand to hold the ruler. So the mini ditch offers me stability. So let me show you. I'm going around this curve right here. All right now I'm going to go up and I can guide this. I'm going slow so you can see. I can guide this so easily. It doesn't take a lot of pressure. Actually, it's hardly any pressure at all. And I use it to help me go around the shape and I can come up you can go as fast as you want but honestly it helps keep me right next to the shape that needs to be quilted and now you can probably hear there's drums going in the background I have a son who is home and he is playing drums he's he's recording so I'm hoping it's not too loud it'd be better if the music was like with my quilting <laughs> All right, so now I'm going to go around this shape. And again, I am stitching slow just so that you can see. It just offers me stability. So if you're interested in my mini ditch ruler, I have it. I will have it on my website. It's um, nancymcnallyquilts.com. Or you can email me directly if you're interested. nancymcnallyquilts at gmail.com. Have a wonderful day and happy quilting.